going to be the widget for Facebook and Twitter. We have these widgets here. What we're simply going to do is change the length of them, try to match them up. So simply what you're going to do is you're going to sign into your website, your WordPress website, and you can either, um, and you can actually go down once you go to the back end and go to widgets. After you go to widgets, what you're going to see is you have the Facebook like box, and then you have the Twitter timeline. So right here is exactly what uh, the section is where you're actually going to change the height of the uh, change the height of the uh, the widgets. So simply what you're going to do, we're going to minimize this. We're going to match them up. So we're going to change this to 400 pixels. Uh, we're going to save it. And we might make this one a little longer just for the heck of it. We'll say 425. And we'll save that as well too. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to actually open up another tab. And just to give you an idea of the change that just occurred, um, you have to make sure that you save each widget. And once you do that, you'll see the size changed. And the size is about equal now. This one's a little bit longer because it's 425. But you see the difference. This one was a lot longer. This one was uh, about the same. Um, but let's just go ahead and make this 400 and save. Oops. And save it below. I have to refresh this, reload it. And you'll see they're about the same size. So that's simply how you adjust the widgets, specifically the Facebook and Twitter widgets, so that it fits on the screen.